Hey guys, what's up? So today we're trying to get face ID on all iPhones, guys. So this works on iPhone 5s, iPhone SE, iPhone 6, iPhone 7, and iPhone 8. These are basically all the iPhones that do not support face ID, and this is how you guys can get. So it's really easy and simple. You guys will need to be jailbroken. So you guys need a jailbreak. Once you guys jailbreak, you want to open up Cydia, and you guys want to add a source. So add the source you guys see on your screen, or um, I put the source down in the description for you guys to add. So once you guys add the source, you guys can just either tap onto the source and tap on all packages, and it's called Epilency iOS 11. So you want to tap on that, and you want to install that. So you also could also search from the bottom to search it up. But if you have a lot of sources, it could be difficult to find the right one. So I prefer um, installing it from the source, unless you have just this source. Um, so you know you're installing the right one. So if it looks something like this, um, then you're installing the right one. So like I said, just tap on install. It says modify for me because I already have it installed. And you want to install it. And right now it only works for iOS 11. So if you're on the iOS 12 jailbreak, this might not work because it's only for iOS 11. They might update in the future, but like I said, right now it's just iOS 11. So basically, it lets you unlock your device with face recognition via camera. So pretty cool. It definitely works. And it's not obviously as good as Face ID for like the iPhone X, XR, and XMATS. It's S mats, but it's still something that's really, really cool. So once you guys install it, you guys will get an app. So we'll go over to the so that's the app right there, Epilency. And basically, when you guys open up, it's gonna basically open up your camera, and you guys basically tap on you know you want to add a person, and then you want to tap on your person, and then you got to add photos. You want to add different photos, different um, sites of the camera, so like different angles of the camera. So then the camera could be like close to your face, far away from your face. The more photos you have, and the more and different lighting of photos you have of yourself, the more um, it's gonna it's more likely gonna work with your um, face ID. So you do the people and then you do the recognize which is going to start the camera and then basically the camera is going to like i guess take different pictures of yourself also guys it is in your settings so when you guys go to settings you want to open up settings and then you want to scroll down so here it is and you tap on it make sure it's enabled tap on settings and you basically have um all this some settings you should mess around with and play with so i like to it says don't start when music so basically when you're playing music it won't start which i like to have that off because you know if you're listening to music I still want to use my face ID for it. So there's some settings you guys just, um, just choose depending on what you want. And the only clips I really found about this is that, like, let's say you unlock your device and you're just looking at your notifications. It will automatically just swipe up your notifications for some reason if it, like, if it recognizes your face. I don't like about that. But other than that, it works really, really good. You just press the button and then you just tap on it, um, the home button. So I'm going to do it for you guys. Tap on it. Tap on again, and then it was say epilepsy started, and it's going to look at your face, and then go. I only have five photos, so it doesn't really recognize my face that much. But I'm also, just, it might show like a little video on top, or like a little camera, of like what you look like, so you can basically see what it sees. And sometimes the sometimes like the video like pauses, and you just got to turn the device like off, just like that, turn back on, and then it'll work. So it's really weird, but it's, it works, and it's really, really cool. So guys, that wraps up my video. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions or concerns, please leave them down below. I'm more happy to help you guys out. Well, than that, peace.